속에 입해진 나 단지 사라질 뿐이야 우리 가슴 속에 뜨거웠던 나 너의 파도 속을 헤맬 때 숨을 쉴 수가 없어 서로 닿을 듯한 거리여도 아직 말할 순 없어 너에게만은 들킬 수 없는 내맘날볼수 없어 난 미친 것 같아 다 아직 할 말이 남아있는데 너는 모르니 미친 것 같아 다 아직 할 말이 남아있는데 너는 모르니 What really Chuseok is um, a harvest celebration, um, celebrated typically uh, in the fall, harvest, full moon. One thing that maybe we should try to maintain is just the idea that it's a time when we can get together and have a meal and really sort of enjoy in community. And I think that's what Gilpo has tried to do today. So thank you so much for being here. The ethos of family today is to be a bit more expansive and generative in thinking about all the ways we can express ourselves openly, artistically, creatively, and communally, and to support the visual arts, literature, poetry, education, oral histories, public intergenerational discourse. We all hold many bodies of knowledge, experience, and complexity that can be explored and expressed through the arts. And it behooves us to grow a community that encourages the next generation to really think about the arts as a medium, a means, a space, and a community for diaspora Koreans, especially here in LA. I really can't tell you how happy I am to be a writer during this time of kind of, I would say, a Kyoko Renaissance. Um, and much of that is amplified and supported by Kyoko, the organization. Because we're bringing it and we're not waiting for it. We're not waiting for the white gatekeepers. We're taking it. It's not about waiting around. It's about like making your work and also finding the support from our community. As we take pride in all that kind of achieve, like the kind of beauty and power that we have in a room like this, um, that we can uh, take pride in for what's happening in Korea now. I also think that um, you know many of us have been driven to succeed and to be self-sufficient. But something that's like very important also is to be able to lean on each other and to take care of one another and to be weak and vulnerable sometimes and to call each other in sometimes. We think of this as a refuge. It's, it's, Gyopo is a place where we can safely come together and ask ourselves hard questions about what it means to be of the diaspora here.